99% sites online are affiliated, working for the credit card companies and giving you dishonest and misleading sugar-coated information, trying to sell you credit cards and making money off you. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. If you're looking for unbiased, non-affiliated and honest uh, credit card reviews and information, then you're at the right place. Today I'll talk about Brim World Elite MasterCard, why I decided to cancel this card and why it didn't make sense for me anymore to keep this card paying $199 annually. Brim sent me an email about a year ago notifying that uh, the annual fee will go up from $120 to $199 and uh, they had uh, they mentioned the reasons uh, in this email why they're increasing the annual fee. Uh, this is the first time I heard any credit card which increased their annual fee from $120 to $199 even be, uh, before issuing their credit cards because when I got this email that time the BIM uh, credit cards didn't uh, come out yet so the first time I heard a credit card company is increasing annual fee even before the credit cards reaching uh, the customers hands so if you look at the email that uh, they're mentioning here that you know uh, the features and benefits they're giving are equal to $399 to $799 annual fee credit cards but when you look at the benefits they are actually not even equal to $120 per year annual fee credit card for example if you look at the benefits they're just uh, doubling up uh, their insurances uh, they're not actually adding any benefits for example uh, here they're mentioning that you know they have 0% uh, for transaction fees free global Wi-Fi security features and two points for every one dollar spent but these features were there uh, even before uh, the free increase and these didn't change so what is changing they're just changing the annual fee so if you just uh, you know go through the email then they're just you know doubling up or uh, sometimes like you know 2.5 uh, percent 2.5 times increase of uh, can uh, insurances for example trip in interruption and trip cancellation lost baggage delay insurance and lost and stolen baggage insurance emergency medical travel insurance mobile device insurance so they're just uh, you know uh, playing a trick here because uh, most people who have this card they're not going to be using these insurances every year so when you travel possibly you're gonna need a travel insurance to actually apply or actually you're going to have bad luck and you'd require insurances once in a while I've been traveling for how many years 20 years uh, 25 years and I never had any I never had to claim any insurance ever for these years so they know that you know increasing these insurances really doesn't mean anything because most people will not be like you know claiming this anyway uh, once in a while probably like you know a very uh, few handful of people will claim this so it doesn't cost them anything because no one is claiming these insurances and then they just want to make mon more money by increasing the hundred uh, annual fee to hundred ninety nine dollars so there's no reason for uh, anyone to pay hundred ninety nine dollars to credit card which doesn't give you concierge service doesn't give you lounge access free lounge passes uh, recurring annual uh, gift or bonus uh, for example a free hotel night or free points each year so basically this card doesn't have any benefits uh, except the insurances and foreign transaction fee and even there's uh, for uh, the foreign transaction fee is very questionable because uh, BREAM does not use uh, MasterCard's own foreign transaction fee they make up their own foreign currency uh, exchange fee and there's a room for their them to just like in you know, a charge whatever they want because they're using their own fee so I don't see any uh, point here why would I pay $199 for a credit card which has no benefits uh, just you know insurance uh, benefits features and uh, one point or two two points per dollar spent benefits which is not a big deal let me uh, just make clear that by canceling BRIM World Elite uh, MasterCard, I am not actually coming out of BRIM altogether. So I'm just uh, canceling my BRIM World Elite MasterCard and I'm transferring to the no annual fee version of BRIM regular credit card. So in that way, I don't lose some of the uh, rewards I have 
already accumulated under BIM Org Elite uh, Mastercard. So those viewers will be transferred to the BIM regular version. And I'm not losing the credit uh, limit which I was issued under uh, BIM Org Elite Card. So the main differences between these two cards is the reverse structure and it doesn't have any insurance offer. So for example, with the BIM regular uh, credit card, you earn one, one point per dollar or one percent return. And with the BIM World Elite, you earn two points or two percent return. And But this card has, has some of the good features uh, which BIM World Elite has. For example, you can still have a zero percent for transaction fee uh, which is BIM's own rate not uh, MasterCard's own rate then uh, also you can have free Boingo global Wi-Fi so that actually uh, it's a very good feature to have uh, stating the fact that you're not paying any annual fee and you're still getting the free global Wi-Fi so that's my another reason and then if you look at the other things then uh, it just doesn't have the insurances or any lounge key but you know for lounge key brim doesn't actually give you any free lounge passes it just give you the free lounge subscription so each time you enter a lounge you still have to pay so that's uh, no point uh, you know uh, keeping the world elite for that as well and then uh, insurances it doesn't have that much insurances some of them you just have a little bit uh, for example purchase security or uh, extended warranty but if you look at travel your insurances it has almost it has almost nothing you can see that you know all these are no no looks like that's all the differences between the brim regular and brim or elite mastercard i'll continue keeping the brim regular version credit card paying at zero annual fee and i'll use the boingo global wi-fi free and uh, that's why i cancelled uh, the beam world elite and I switched my my credit limit to beam uh, regular version credit card forget about subscribing this channel forget about liking this video thank you for watching and I'll see you shortly